right, we'll talk about an activity for everyone here. Seniors through toddlers, a local farm is offering new barn babies program where you can actually cuddle with a baby goat. All right, and they are so cute. <laughs> News 8 Sarah Cody makes some furry friends from Southington during today's Connecticut Families Report. Hi guys, come on Rosewell, come on in. Since opening Bradley Mountain Farm a few years ago, Annalise Dadris keeps thinking of ways to share her oasis. There's a lot of things you can do when you want to interact with animals. Now folks can hang out with these cute and curious little critters. Here's a girl, you can say hi to her. During a new experience. Here's our twin. With an appropriate name. This is Barn Babies, where we're going to go into their environment and meet them with their moms. Uh, it makes them very relaxed because they're not, you know, they're in their own house. So far, five babies have been born this season. These guys are about three weeks old, and a few more are due soon. They join a herd of about 40 that lives in harmony in this Southington barnyard. They're very chill compared to dogs. They're they're much more they're they're, they're much more cuddly. They like to sit with you. They like to just be. The babies are teeny. <laughs> adorable and unpredictable. I have three babies on me. Yes, my hair. And, and yes, they love humans hair. It's actually like kind of like hair? a binky for them. These little goats will grow to take part in strolls, yoga, and Van Gogh painting, all of the many programs offered at this bucolic destination. We also have um, an overnight where you can actually sit by the campfire, do a little activity in, at night, and then wake up in the morning to the goats and the chickens. Dadris hopes visitors leave yeah. feeling both joyful and relaxed. I want them to remember what it was like, and, and I also want to give them a good feeling. And I think the goats do. They, they, they just love you unconditionally. They were so, so cute. Now the farm sees visitors by reservation and there's always plenty of availability. Head to the Connecticut Families page of WTNH.com for much more information. I'm Sarah Cody, News 8.